this is Lee with the Inquirer and I'm at an Intel event in London today with Bossa Nova Robotics and their MOBA, MOBI robot prototype. Uh, would you like to explain some of the main features of the device please and how it works? Hi, yeah. uh, my name is Martin, I'm the CEO of Bossa Nova Robotics and we build a uh, robot called MOBI. And MOBI is truly unique for a number of different reasons. First and foremost, if you look at the very bottom here, MOBI balances on a single ball. And the single ball means that we are always physically compliant. And by that we mean if we get bumped into in any direction, we'll always move out of the way. We also follow the physics of an inverted pendulum, which means that we balance on a single point and have the weight at the top of the robot. This allows us to be tall and narrow. And then finally, the ball, of course, is omnidirectional, which makes it very, very easy to navigate in very complex spaces because we can essentially change direction without having to turn around. So omnidirectional, physical compliance, and tall and narrow are the three real magical uh, properties of this particular robotic platform. You will first see it deployed uh, in retail stores where we are scanning, scanning shelves to look for inventory compliance. And for that we mean low stock, out of stock, or misplaced items. We track those items against what should be on a shelf versus what is missing, and then we notify store associates to be able to then address those uh, miss out of stock items. And is this um, what? How does it see the item on the shelf? I mean, what, how does it work? Is it so? A, a if I show you here we're using a connect right now this is the first generation connect from Microsoft and this allows us to see in 3d so it allows us to do a couple of things one orientate ourselves to the shelves identify obstacles that are in our way as well as identify what it is that we're looking at on the shelf so we use the first generation connect now we're in the process of switching to the new Xbox one connect. And what was that happening in the event that it, it got sort of knocked over? How does it? So, like anything, if you hit it hard enough, it'll fall over. I do the same. But with this particular robot, unfortunately, we don't have it built in this prototype, but I'd urge you to check our website out. We have safety legs, six safety legs, that will deploy in the event that the robot leans beyond six degrees. And by that, the legs are released in a fraction of a second without power. They're what we call self-extracting. It means we cut the power to them, they instantly deploy, and that stabilizes the robot and gives it enough time to be able to recalibrate its balance, retract the legs, and then move on to what it's doing. Great. Cool. Thank you very much.